everyone this is your kalpana here so in this video we are going to discuss a problem from partial fractions let's get started problem resolve x square plus 5x plus 7 by x minus 1 whole cube into partial fractions Firstly, we will check whether the given fraction is a proper fraction or improper fraction. Okay. So, we are given x squared plus 5x plus 7 by x minus 1 whole cube. Let it be p of x by p of x. Let us consider it as p of x by p of, p of x. So, here p of x is x squared plus 5x plus 7. The degree of p of x is 2 and the degree of q of x is obviously 3. Okay. If you want, you can check using the formula a minus b whole cube which is equals to a cube minus b cube minus 3ab into a minus b. Okay x cube minus 1 minus 3 into x into 1 into x minus 1. So this equals to x cube minus 1 minus 3x into x minus 1. So this equals to x, min x cube minus 1 minus 3x square minus into minus plus 3x. So you can write it as x cube minus 3x square plus 3x minus 1. Okay, now it is clear that the degree of Q, Q of X is 3. Okay, so so it is clear that degree of P of X is less than degree of q of x. 2 is less than 3, right? So, degree of p of x is less than degree of q of x. From this, we can say that the given fraction is a proper fraction. Therefore, the given fraction is a Proper fraction. Okay. Good. Now coming to the problem. Given proper fraction x square plus 5x plus 7 by x minus 1 whole cube. Now we'll consider the denominator, the fraction, not fraction, the polynomial, linear polynomial x minus 1 equals to some y. Let x minus 1 equals to y, then x equals to y plus 1. Now simply we'll replace x in terms of y. Okay, now x square plus 5x plus 7 by x minus 1 whole cube can be written as, now we are going to replace x by y plus 1 whole square plus 5 into x, 5 into y plus 1 plus 7 by x minus 1 is replaced by y cube. Okay. So, this equals to a plus b whole square. Since a plus b whole square equals to a square plus b square plus 2ab. So, now you can find for y plus 1 whole square y square plus 1 plus 2y plus plus 
5 into y is 5y plus 5 into 1 is 5 plus 7 by y cube. Okay. So this is equals to y square plus 1 plus 2y plus 5y plus 5 plus 7 by y cube is equals to y square plus 2y plus 5y is 7 by plus 1 plus 5 6 6 plus 7 13 by y cube okay so in the numerator you're having three terms so you can split the whole term into three terms so you can write it as y squared by y cube plus 7y by y cube plus 13 by y cube okay So this is equals to, again, you can cancel directly or else you can write y squared by y cube can be written as y, y squared into y plus 7 into y by y cube can be written as y squared into y plus 13 by y cube. Okay, y squared, y squared gets cancelled y y gets cancelled so this is equals to 1 by y plus 7 by y square plus 13 by y cube okay now we have to change everything in terms of x we'll replace x by y since we are having you have to replace y right since we are having y equals to x minus y, since y equals to x minus y, so we'll replace y by x minus 1. Okay, let's replace. So this is equals to 1 by y. y equals to x minus 1. Replace x by. Replace y by x minus 1. Plus 7 by y square. You're having y equals to x minus 1. Plus 13 by y cube. So you got x squared plus 5x plus 7 by x minus 1 whole cube equals to 1 by x minus 1 plus 7 by x minus 1 whole square plus 13 by x minus 1 whole cube. So therefore x squared plus 5x plus 7 by x minus 1 whole cube equals to 1 by x minus 1 plus 7 by x minus 1 whole square 
प्लस थर्टीन बाई एक्स माइनस वन होल क्यूब so this completes the problem we have resolved the proper fraction into partial fractions okay so we have seen a problem from partial fractions in this video hope you will understand we'll see you in the next video until then bye bye